Hello, this is Zero Productions, and as you are seeing on the screen, this is my Nintendo Switch skin. It is a, or deco, it's like, well, it's both of them, technically. Stickers on and all that. It is a, uh, NES skin, and I really like it. It's not perfect, though, and I'll get onto that later, but I'm going to be going through right now, uh, the quality, the shipping, and its flaws. So, basically, for shipping... It, it was it said it would come on the 24th and as you can tell in the video the 24th is five days away so it showed up on like the 18th ish 17th so it was like it was like already like a week early so I was surprised when I got it then the quality of it though is something that I, I'm gonna get into as well so basically when um, I'm just gonna go through all the different parts starting with the actual uh, controller like the um, the grip it didn't come with a pro uh, skin. I didn't have a pro skin, so I didn't really care about that. Or like a pro controller. Um, the uh, the what I thought about when I got the um, the grip is how like it just it it it's a pretty pretty nice how they have the little centerpiece. But I have an NES controller right here. Here, let me get it. I have an NES controller right here. You'll see one on the screen, and. I see what they were trying to do, but it would have been better if they, like, um, I guess if they just did, um, kind of, like, more of a select and start thing. I understand what they are trying to do, and yeah, there's no select and start button on the center, but they could at least have, like, arrows pointing or something, or, like, the Nintendo logo or th stuff. It just felt kind of cheap, but that, 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 it was still good quality, and I like it. So, the straps, we're going on to those next, they just look like a grip. You can see, like, the little centerpiece, they, they just look like a grip. They're not really anything special, so that was a kind of disappointment. Uh, and then next, we have the actual system, and as you can see, it's, like, yeah, it's just a system. There's not really much to say. It has the little NES, like, um, little edge around it, which I guess is interesting. Lots of people like it, um, but, uh, especially with the Joy-Cons on, it looks... It looks kind of like an NES. In the dock, it looks more like an NES. Well, of course, because it has to look like an NES um, in the dock because it's an NES skin. But, yeah. Next, we have the Joy-Con. The Joy-Con is what another thing I get pra praised a lot, or the thing gets praised a lot for. It has nice, um, you know, normal buttons. It's got, like, the little analog stick. And um, when it's in the grip, it looks a lot better as you'll see in the video it looks a lot more like an actual like something you would picture in an nes uh in like an nes uh deco which this is so that's a good thing that i like besides that there's not really much to say about the joy cons they have nothing on the edges which is kind of sad but yeah moving on to the dock this is the thing i like the most so the dock it has like this really NES looking like it, it, I know it's supposed to be an NES skin but it's it looks the most NES out of everything here um so yeah it looks the it looks a lot like an NES console as you will see um it has like the retro um text which is nice and yeah that's pretty much what I gotta say for the dock it's, it's got the USB ports on the side nothing on the back though which is kind of sad but yeah Alright guys, so that's pretty much it, and if you want to check this out, it'll be in the description below. And, do you think I should, um, am I gonna recommend this? Um, I would just wait for the pre-order. I'm gonna keep it around because it's, I, we paid for it, and it's nice. It's not horrible, it's still good, but it could be better. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy this video, and see you.